Hello everyone, Liliana from Vanilla and Ganella here. Welcome back to my channel and to another video. Today is the 18th of December. It's a Friday, the same day I'm going to upload this video for you, just a bit later on. I am waiting for Tesco's delivery. This will bring all our Christmas food. It is quite early, but it is the last one I could get. And I thought if it is missing something, I can always try and venture into Aldi or something like that at some point next week. I'm hoping not to, okay, but... So, the main thing I've been doing this morning, apart from washing and drying some clothes, is a prepping for the arrival of all of the food. So, I'm gonna show you a haul when it gets here, but I'm also gonna show you how I'm gonna store everything, because not everything's gonna fit in the fridge, not everything, you know. I intend to set up a little area for all the snacks um, which will be open for business this evening. Paul finishes work today, she'll be home early afternoon and then Christmas starts for us. It's just going to be the three of us so we're going to make, well let me rephrase that, the four of us. It's not that I've forgotten Oscar, it's just that Oscar doesn't eat apart from his milk so he's not going to partake in any of the the lovely food we're going to have but yeah the four of us it's just going to be us so we're going to make the most of it taking the time to watch christmas movies go for walks eat and then eat again eat a little bit more have another walk and maybe eat a bit more after that have some coffee in between you get it right are you going to be doing the same i really hope so it's been a hell of a year we're ready for it to be over and for 2021 to come. But in the meantime, we're going to make the most of it. Enough chattering. Let me show you what I've been doing so far. I gave the fridge a quick wipe down, made sure there was nothing that was off. This is leftovers that we're going to have for lunch. Might change that into my cheese and ham container, but I'm going to wait until the shopping comes. Yeah everything has been wiped down the fridge is pretty much ready as well now it is the dreariest day ever it's really really dark so i'm not sure you're going to be able to see very well oh it's not too bad the pantry is doing okay that in there is all christmas food so basically snacks um but as you can see there's some empty stuff from milk and cereal more crisps you know, but this is how it's looking. And then in this area, I'm going to set up all the savoury stuff. And then over there, I'm probably going to do the more sweet or the baking stuff. Usually I'd put the baking stuff here, but I still need to make some gingerbread and another bit of baking. So I want this to be fairly clear and not loads of stuff on it. I got some Tupperwares out ready to store all the stuff in the fridge. But if you guys want to see the reality, so this overflowing recycling, I'm going to wait until all the recycling from the shopping is done before emptying. But look, waiting to go in the washing machine. But apart from that, everything's clean. And most importantly, the baby sleeps. <laughs> Hi. Okay, as usual, let's start with the frozen stuff. I have some sweet and sticky ribs. These are Alex's favorite. Some Vianetta. This will probably be for Christmas Day. It's like Paul's favorite. Some prawns. I'm gonna use these to make um, prawn cocktail on Christmas Day. Chips for whenever mash from whenever. Let me put this away and I'll come back. Stuff for the fridge. Have some pork pies, some grated cheddar, blue Stilton. This is for Paul. I do not like Stilton. Soft cheese, butter, some smoothies for Alex, double cream, our favourite dip and some of these meat croquettes. Then we've got steak mince, some bacon, some sausages and then 
I was going to cook this for Christmas Day because bear in mind it's just for three of us to eat. Oscar doesn't eat. But then I saw this and it was half price. So for this small joint of beef, it was £5.68. So I have never cooked beef like this. So I'm going to have to Google it. But I'm maybe doing this for Christmas and I'll keep this for New Year or for another day in the week. It doesn't matter. And then got some sprouts, mushrooms, thing of lettuce, some cauliflower, broccoli and celery. Okay, and now everything else. I have got some of these uh, tortilla wraps, sweet and salty popcorn, these little Kit Kat Santas. <gasps> Oh my goodness, you have to try this if you haven't. For me, these have been the um, the Christmas chocolate this year. I have just loved those. Got some uh, croissants there. I bought a trifle kit. I might not make it, but in case Paul really wants it, I'll, I might make one. Pot baked baguettes, thing, two things of eggs. We love these crisp bakes. Two things of a bread there, that's white bread. That's to, one of them is to use in a recipe. There's some tiger bread, cinnamon sticks, two of Alex's bread, some uh, passion fruit, onions, potatoes and carrots. And you've already seen those bits there. And then drinks, you guys. We got some soya milk, two things of Diet Coke, some Fanta, some cream soda. Do you guys like this? I think that is vile, but this is like Christmas for Paul. The other thing that is Christmas for Paul is avocado. Do you have this? We mix this with a lemonade. Some people add ice cream, but we're not going to do that. There's also some beer, some lager. This is to make shandy with a lemonade. And then some hot dogs, some beef gravy, Branston pickle some tuna, two things of crisps, and four things of frosted flakes. I have some Tesco's non-bio laundry detergent here and some kitchen towel. And there is also two things of cat litter and nappies that I won't bother showing you because they're too heavy. Okay, so everything is fully stocked, prepped, where that can be prepped. All the veg actually fit in here and there. This is like cheese, all the meat in here, drinks. And then I've frozen the chicken. There's bread freezing as well. And then by the coffee station, I have some of our sweet treats like um, Ferrero, some biscuits, some of those Kit Kat. I am, as you guys know, the queen of decanting stuff. I don't know why. I might even decant that just because I like it all. I don't know. I just like it. I tried one of these. I officially opened them and they're okay. I mean, there's... Yeah, they're okay. I wouldn't buy them again, maybe. But I wouldn't not have them again, if that makes sense. I've just kept the onions there, so I remind myself to use them as I go. There's the fruit. And then on this side, I just got some of these savoury snacks. You know, the little crackers, cheesy savouries. And some nuts there, ready to be used. Then Everything else is in the pantry, loads of bread, there's more snacks there. So I'll be replacing them as we go along. All the crisps, bread and breakfast stuff, milk. Yeah, all of that. So all of our drinks are right here by the back door. The ones that don't fit in the fridge and we can just come and pick them up and they'll be nice and cold. And I guess... That is it, you guys. That is me done with filming before Christmas. I hope you all have a wonderful time this Christmas. And may 2021 be everything you've ever dreamed of. All there is left for me to say 
is Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Go outside, the snow is falling down and every child is